Hi, good day. It's Roland of uh, Rollwing YouTube channel. Into this video, I'm going to teach you how you can create uh, your YouTube branding watermark for free that showed up on every video that you're going to create in your YouTube channel. Although branding watermark is a basic and image or logo that is located at the top bottom of your YouTube channel, it's still a good way that you will help you to, to gain more subscribers in your YouTube channel. If you're still new to my channel, just click the subscribe button and the notification bell so that you'll be updated on my upcoming videos. I have also some of the tips on different uh, niche and uh, topic by going to my website at www.rollwing.com. So come and join me. We'll go to the computer and we'll show you how you can create your YouTube branding watermark for free. Okay, so we are now in our computer. In order for you to put the YouTube branding uh, watermark, you need to have an image or the what we call the subscribe icon button so that you can put in your uh, YouTube channel. But if you don't have, then we can create a new one and I will teach you how to create a new YouTube branding uh, watermark. If you notice, there's a lot of subscribes icon button or watermark that you can search in Google. So just type YouTube subscriber square so once you go to search for the YouTube subscribe square there's a lot of uh, images or uh, icon that you can use but uh, the thing is that this all of this uh, all of these uh, icon or images are already familiar so so you need to have your own uh, watermark so that it would be unique for your brand and for your uh, YouTube channel. So, but uh, if you don't want to create a new one, then you just uh, download any of these uh, images, then you can put as a watermark. But for now, since our YouTube tutorial is about how to create a new and unique YouTube branding watermark, so I'm going to teach you. So first, there is a new, there is an app that we are going to use. This app is a uh, free, but uh, they have also a premium, and then it will include lots of uh, premium images the name of the apps is canva so just type canva.com then press enter okay so once you click the canva.com you can either sign up it or login so if you already have an account with uh, canva.com then you can log in but if you don't have any account yet you can sign up and then just select the free one so in my case, I already have a Canva, so I've just log in and then sign on, log in with my email and my password. So click login. Okay, since uh, Watermart has a specific size and that is 150 by 150 pixels. So now we're going to create the Watermart. So just cl click create the design. And then you can select so there's a lot of menu that you can you can select from this one but since we don't have any watermark uh, available in this uh, canva.com so we can create or customize the dimension of our uh, image so just click custom dimension and then since our watermark watermark should have a size of 150 by 150 pixels so just put 150 by 150 pixels and then create a new design so once you click a create a new design so it will put this uh, template design which are going to create for a YouTube branding watermark so first we are going to put a background color so we're going to select from all this menu so there's a upload then photo you can create select any photo and then elements text music video and then background so we're going to create a background so we're going to create this we're going to go to elements and then i like this one so just click this one or drag it here 
okay once you drag it here it will put it here and then you can resize the image so we will resize the image according to this uh, format uh, 150 by 150 so just fill it up don't uh, go beyond this one beyond this uh, border because uh, it will mess up the size so once you put it here you have now the background so you can actually uh, change the color of your border or your uh, color the inside of this uh, background so in my case i wanted to uh, change the color to make it more unique and we will just follow the color of the youtube so in my border i will just select this one this is a color of our border so i will just select color red and then for my inner color this is our inner color so i'll just click this one and then i'll click this we just we will just select the uh, br the more lighter one so that uh, our youtube branding watermark will be visible to the uh, to the uh the one who view our youtube so i'll just click this i like this agua blue so i just click it here and then the color will be changed so now it will look like a, a good uh, watermark so the next part is how we're going to put a text so the next one is how we're going to click this text and then you can select what text format are you going to put but uh, in my case i'll just make it a basic one so i'll just click this add the heading letter so i just put click here too okay i'll just uh, make it more bigger so i just click enter and then i can resize this uh, text so you can resize the text according to your uh, preference what size are you prepared to show in your uh, youtube branding so in my case i'll make it uh, more bigger so that it will be visible for the user that uh, who will uh, view my youtube okay i will make it more bigger i think uh, okay i will make it in the center so you can you can drag it any in a place you want you can drag it and you can resize so in my case i'll just put it here I make some uh, good uh, distance from the top okay I think this one is good okay so in my case I don't want the color so I might uh, change the color to white you can change the color by clicking here so select white and then if you're going to click outside so the color will be changed okay the next part is we're going to put the word subscribe and then we will see some some good design and put it here so the next thing is uh, I will still go to elements and then I'll click again this one and then I'll put the word subscribe inside of this uh, box so I'm going to resize uh, you can resize uh, according to your preference okay okay I think this one is good so I just make it in the center okay i think this one is good and then i'm going to change the color of this uh, inside color so i'll just click this one and then i'll, I'll make uh, choose it uh, i might put a white color okay and then since this one is too uh, dark red so i'm going to change it also to the uh, same color as this one so i choose this one so yeah i think this one is good what do you think i think this one is good and then the next i'm going to go to text to put the word uh, subscribe so again i'm going to select from this different uh, font or formatted font so i think i think this one is good so since it's free i can use it so i'll just click it or i just click it and then i don't want this format so i like only this one so I just uh, click this one and then I click delete so I only have this one okay then I'm, I'm going to change the color also so I make it uh, red also red and then I'm going to reduce the size so I'll go here reduce the size to maybe 12 or I make I will make it uh, more visible 
more bigger okay we'll see if uh, this one is good okay okay we'll try to put the word subscribe oh i think it's bigger so we need to reduce the size so that it fits to our and then because we're go still going to put uh, some some images inside of that one inside of that box so i might okay i might uh, reduce this one to maybe 14 or 12 oh no i think i'm going to reduce this to 12 okay yeah i think this one is good and then i might put it here and then maybe i can reduce the box okay because we're still going to put some some more images okay you can always resize the box if you want according to your preferences okay this one again okay, we can still okay I think this one is good and then we'll go back to the elements we'll see if the elements oh no i think i think we go to photo yeah again we go to photo and then search for youtube we will select some images uh free images of youtube in this uh screen okay so i think this one we can select this one since it's free so we can just drag it and put it here and then we can reduce and put it inside the box okay okay we'll try if it is will okay so it's much bigger i think we are going to reduce the word subscribe okay i think we need to e make it equal to other side oh i think this one is there okay i think this one is good now yeah i think this one is good okay i think this one is good so we are i think we need to put more images so i think uh if we can uh, search for hen see if we have hen uh, oh that's not the hand that we're looking for maybe we can go to element okay i think this one is good since it's free we can use it so we can drag it here okay this one is really good okay so you can flip the hands by clicking this one so you got a, if you go here and then flip it so you can flip this hand so that and then you can also reduce the size if you want okay so let's see reduce the size okay yeah we can reduce the size and then we can put it here i think we have a good uh, watermark now okay so i think this one is good and then if you want you can change the color so i think the black one is good but we can change the black the the white uh, color inside so click this white color and then may maybe we can change it to also to uh, red okay so i think this one is good what do you think i think this one is good we make it more uh, uh bigger so that uh, it will be uh, viewable when they go to our uh, uh, youtube uh, video i think this one is good so what do you think i think this one is a unique uh, watermark branding of your youtube and i think and nobody still uh, has this kind of uh, watermark so once you're done just click here and then maybe you can change the, the file name to subscribe button and then uh, you can download this file so but first be sure to save your file so that you can come back later on so just click save so it will be automatically saved since i'm good with this one i'll go to add download and then be, be sure to check the size 150 by 150 pixels and then just click download so once you download it will be automatically download to downloads folder so it will preparing your uh, design and then yeah it will automatically download to your uh, desktop so this uh, file will go to downloads folder so just click continue and then you're done with this uh, creation of uh, youtube uh, branding watermark so the next part is uh, we're going to put that uh, youtube branding watermark to our uh, youtube channel 
Okay, so we just finished the creation of our YouTube channel watermark. So the next part is to put the watermark in our YouTube channel. So you're going to log in now to your YouTube and then once you log in, you click this uh you click your picture and then go to YouTube Studio. Click YouTube Studio and then once you click the YouTube Studio, it will go to this screen and then go to settings. And then once you go to settings, go to channel. So when you're in the channel, just click the branding, click this branding. So you will notice that there is a watermark that was uh, previously put in your uh, YouTube channel. So we're going to change this uh, watermark. So first I'm going to remove the, the old watermark, remove, and then we're going to place the newly created YouTube branding watermark that we just created. So click choose image and then we go to this uh, download the previously we downloaded and this is the one that we have been created in our canva.com. So just click this uh, watermark and then click open and then it will automatically put in your uh, every video that you'll be uploaded in your uh, YouTube channel. So in this uh, display time, you can choose either you're going to put the watermark in end of video or you can put it in a custom start time. So in this case, it is a five seconds and then it will appear the watermark or you just click the entire video to show this watermark. So in my case, I usually put the entire video. I usually click the entire video so that all the uploaded video, my, mat my watermark will will display on each video from the beginning up to the uh, up to the last part of my video so once i place my watermark and then i click save so that's the that's the uh, correct way on putting your watermark in your youtube channel so we're going to check our video and we will try to look if uh, the watermark has been placed in, our, in every video that we place in our YouTube channel. Okay, upon checking the video, the newly created watermark has been successfully placed in our video. In our example video, you can see the newly created watermark. This wraps up our tutorial for today. So if you have any question, just uh, put any comments in the comment section. If you are still new to my channel, just click the subscribe button and the notification bell so that you will be updated on my upcoming videos. Again, thank you and have a good day. Bye-bye.